Welcome back guys to another GTA 5 walkthrough in 2020 and in today's video what we're going to be doing is actually continuing on the series and if you guys missed the last video I will link it down below I will leave a link to the entire GTA 5 2020 playlist in the description below so be sure to go check it out if you haven't already now we all know Rockstar Games is trying to milk GTA as much as possible so they're going to be releasing GTA 5 for the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5 as well and you better bet I'm gonna be doing another series over there too so there's gonna be a series here 2020 GTA 5 2020 seven years later and there's gonna be a, another series next year when it does release in the I think I think it's the later half of 2021 but when it does release I'm gonna do another walkthrough just because of the graphics improvements and stuff like that that I do want to check out what are you talking about bro jeez all right so in the last video I won't spoil it too much but we came from Sandy Shores and we came to visit Ron's cousin uh, I forgot his name but he lives here in uh, in Los Santos right by the beach so what do we need to do we need to go visit our friend that's what we need to do so you've probably never seen me at all he just revved the truck on his own dude that was cool okay so the whole point of us coming down to los santos was to visit an old friend michael right so we need to come over here to his place and basically we're gonna ruin his day <laughs> we're gonna absolutely poop on his beautiful day so all right let's go let's book it over there if you guys do enjoy this series make sure to subscribe and tap that bell icon to be notified about future series Ooh, what's this hold up there's a little blue dot don't be a dick bro i'm trying to look out for you just give me the key whatever dad totally fine had a couple of beers they're about? they're drinking and driving I'm not gonna help them <laughs> I'm Trevor I don't care just make out already well why is he talking we're like so far all right let's continue our story let's book it over there what do you this is why turn signals are a thing I agree all right Be sure to smack that like button if you guys do enjoy this as well. I know I already said that if you enjoy to subscribe and stuff, but if you like it, smash the like button. It'll help support the video and uh, maybe get some more people to view it. So there's that. I'm trying to build a small little community here. And I just want people to have fun, right? Like, I don't want to be the channel where I'm cussing a lot or something like that. I want to be family. Friendly. Like, I understand that the game that I'm playing is not family friendly, but me personally is. I do. I want to be family friendly. Here we go. Alright. His house looks really good, honestly. I thought, I thought the game froze. Shit. Are you looking for this? No. Very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? No. Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Mm, yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this grand? Yeah, well, I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in a big mansion. Awkward situations. <laughs> it's one way of looking at it. Yeah, that's yeah, the truth. Do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all out. A long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. That's great. That's great. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? Hmm. Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. <laughs> nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner, but yeah, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? <laughs> I must stay. I'm Fabian. <sighs> good lord. <laughs> This is so weird. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's a. Uh, oh, my bad. She's a. Uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for Fame or Shame. Fame or Shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it. You guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh Christ! She's a horrible dancer. My Come. God! She might disagree <laughs> with you on that. Jesus Christ! What now? Now where? Um, the Maze Bank Arena. Oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go. We go get her. We? Yeah, we. What are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go. Come on. Oh, I'm driving his car. <laughs> Let's wreck it. Dude, Whoops. <laughs> what were you doing? I was making myself a juice. Broccoli, raw kale, fish oil. This recipe I got is packed with nutrients, fibers, vitamins, and it don't taste bad. I'll send you the recipe. Anyway, get this. I'm making it. The blender slips, juice goes everywhere. I'm about to clean it up when I find this bag of grass. Big fucking bag, Jimmy's, right? Okay, just that moment, Amanda comes in, sees me there. With. I didn't ask for a blow by blow of how you lost your last ounce of masculine pride. <laughs> I wanted to know what you've been doing for a decade. Easy, tea. don't tea me. Hey, if anyone needs kale, my friend, I'm beyond kale. Okay, <laughs> too late for kale. Kale's disgusting. Man, Whoops. <laughs> Kale is disgusting. To have any effect on me. Fine. Or yoga. Or talk therapy. I'm a crank. Cannibalism. An incest kind of guy. Hell. An incest kind of guy. Oh, Why do you say it twice? Worry. They'd skip that talk and go straight to shock treatment with your ass. You two chilled out to say my name, you fat slob. You two relaxed and you laid back Los Santos embarrassment, huh? Is one letter all you can bring yourself to wrap your slothful lips around? Whoa, dude, you do not let the fuck up. I got ten years worth of venting to do. To let up, my friend, is a long way off. Fine, fine. Do what the fuck you want. Want? Jeez. Well, hmm, I, I wanna sit. Oh. <laughs> It didn't let me stop. All right, let's go. Come on, come on. These spaces are reserved for production vehicles. Your mother. <laughs> Anybody else want to talk? Come on, you dipshit. <laughs> ah, that host, man, he's like any closeted TV presenter, bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw that. Where the fuck's Laszlo? Damn. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> that was really. All right. It's the auditions, Fame or Shame, season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. <laughs> Hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like a, oh. a basket full of puppies or a <laughs> rainbow or a pile of puke. Oh. Who are these clowns? Ew. That's my dad and... Trevor? Two dads. Uh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, 
Yeah, what are you doing here? Okay, I'm back. Relax, chill, make yourself at home. We've got a little show to do here. Okay. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music! This is weird. Yeah. Shake what your daddy's gave you, honey. Mm. Look at that. I was stuff a 20 in this. Oh! Can you fucking do something about this? <laughs> I, I, that's enough. Oh! Oh! I said that's enough! Hey! Hey! hey, hey, hey I got security! Security! <laughs> What'd you fucking Hold say? Come on, big guy! Come on! Come on! No! No! Fuck no! <laughs> Yo, okay, honestly, if Trevor wasn't there, if Trevor wasn't there, Michael wouldn't have done any of that nonsense, all right? So, you, you gotta, you gotta respect Trevor. Michael, you, you are super slow. Ah, they towed us. We gotta take the truck. Get in the truck, Michael. But yeah. I got a deposit on that truck. Hurry up, hurry up, get in. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Let's get that trip. Hey, take a left up here. Okay. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Now we gotta chase hey, this idiot. This town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, yeah, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. We're gonna flatten his toy car in this big rig. Don't you worry. Fucking last one. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road. I mean, this thing is it's it weighs a, a lot. Car. Come on. This ain't exactly a racer. For real. I mean, this thing weighs like what? 10 tons? These things are absolutely insane. He went left. I see that. Oh my goodness. Yo, I took that turn so nicely. Look at him. He's on the train tracks. And then Pro tip, do not we get on the train tracks. Well, let's not try to kill this prick, all right? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? We gotta go to the left. I'm going, bro. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little? Huh? It's Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. <laughs> For real. Maybe. Oh my god. Head right up here. All right. So we have to chase Laszlo. We got to basically right, either right Are we going to kill him? Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? 10 fucking minutes at LS. Shut up. That cocksucker might be famous, but oh. But uh he does that a lot, man. He always says, but uh <laughs> We'll get him. We'll get him. But we're sure taking our time about it. Oh my, Michael, you need to like seriously calm your freaking ah, ah, butt. He's going down into the LS River. I can see that. For real, man. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. <laughs> the little shit's all out of juice. Imagine being chased by a big rig. That'd be insane. Hey, hey, hey guys. You run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your talent, uh, huh? I mean, aside from love and sex. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Uh, you proved your point. Uh, this is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Huh? Pants. Off. Uh, uh, okay. There you go. Uh, uh, I'm all right. 
What are you doing now? I want you to dance sexy, celebrité, mm hmm I mean, I need music, or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll, I'll dance. Good. <laughs> all right, all right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice What? How'd they low. use that in there? Come on, How'd they use that without getting, like, a lawsuit? Kill me, okay? Uh -huh. I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right. Please, come on, no, get no. off. Take off. Go now. Before I change my mind. Uh, I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. <laughs> I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> oh shit. Dave. We need to talk. I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay. Meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay. Alright. Well then. So, Trevor met Michael for the first time in nine years. Absolutely insane. And... I gotta say... I don't think Michael would have been able to do any of whatever just happened in this mission without Trevor. So, he has to give a big thanks to Trevor. At least in my opinion. So, with that being said, we need a car. A Prius? Man, get this <laughs> out of here. <laughs> if any of you guys know where that's from, uh, just comment down below. Comment down below where that's from. I'll give you a hint. Ice Cube and Kevin Hart. That's like a massive hint. You can't forget what? But yeah, that's the massive hint. Ice Cube and Kevin Hart. <laughs> oh, I want the car. I want the muscle car. Let's go. Get this stupid Volvo out of here. Well, you don't see, right? Hey, Lester. Mike, hey, uh, I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store take to your account. Madrazo's already got the house money, so you can rest easy there. Ah, thank God for that. Nice. Where's hey, our money? $700,000? Hey, that's nice, bro. That's a very, very, very good chunk of change right there. If I do say so myself. I think that's a really good amount. That's really, really good. Okay. Okay, we need to go over to... Uh, oh, up here. Federal Investigative Bureau. The FIB. Or the FIB of... I mean the FBI of GTA 5. So, let's book it over there. And we gotta see what Mr. Dave wants. Dang, dude, it's insane, man. It is, like, if you really think about it, imagine. To your best friend. You're, you faked your own death. And then you don't tell him about it for nine years. I think that's insane, man. That's absolutely crazy. Like, that's your best friend. Like, your best friend knew your entire family. You guys were, like, super cool dudes. What is this and out of nowhere, it's like, nah. I'm just gonna fake my death and I'm gonna run away. It's like, dude, what do you, what do you, what do you have to be on to do that? Like, what are you smoking? That's crazy, man. Alright, we're almost there. We're about less than a mile there. Let's book it up here. Alright. Let's come up here. Yo, GTA 5 is such a beautiful, like... Like, it's so nicely made. Little drifty drift up there. I'll park it first class right here. Alright, now... Oh, it's a Rolls Royce. Okay. This is the Galileo Observatory, but in real life, it's called the Griffith Observatory. I only 
never been, would really like to visit. I would really love to visit. I want to go to Los Angeles, dude. Like, that's my number one, like, I really do want to go because I want to see the city. Like, I'm obsessed with the city of Los Angeles. Like, just because of the buildings, I love the way it looks. But yeah. Now that that's over with, uh, let's come up here. Davy, <laughs> how you doing? About as good as can be expected, but the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davy, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right, I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life, cause you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it, Trevor. Why do you say it's? Why do you say it like that, Trevor? But if no, when he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border, oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. We're in it together. So, if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that. My problems are sort of your problems. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. Well... And we better go about saving it together, because you and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy, Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently. He has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I going to get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? Did he have to knock me over the head like I that? I always kind of liked you. Call me when you wake up. I swear. What we got? Uh, John Doe, white male, overweight, in his late 40s, possible coroner. Let's take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. We're probably about to find one in his gut, still in its wrapper. Right next to the bottle of scotch and pack of redwoods. See the broken capillaries around the nose? Alcoholic. I wouldn't take any bets on the state of the liver. We still think 40s? Press A to wake up. He's an advert for clean living. Note the discoloration of the teeth and the fingers. Do you guys not see my that? head moving? Don't worry, it's just gas. No, no. It's reanimating. You want to cut it in the Oh, they do see office, it. You're going to have to lose the nerves. I've been around cadavers. This isn't right. Well, fresh is different. The ones you've seen have been on the shelf for a week. You can still smell this guy's breakfast. If you say so. Imagine uh, things I've seen. Imagine uh, grown man, you could fit being in a, a corner, like the corner or whatever. What does it say on his badge? Flesh. This Imagine being there and then seeing, Note seeing the this. Discoloration <laughs> of the teeth and the fingers. Smoker. Pack a day, I'd say. Probably cigars too. I was going like there was no tomorrow. Yeah, he's got that right. Some people think they're immortal. So you get chest pains pumping away at your mistress. Lucky girl having this thing on top of her, huh? She was probably relieved when he bought it. Awkward conversation with the spouse. Might have got some hush money. It's a win-win. But what are they? Losers. No, I'm not. I'm not doing this. What the heck are they talking about? From the dead, motherfucker! All right. Come out! 
Hands in the air. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Might be in the other room. Out now. I want to do this there. in first person because it's. I feel like it's better. Kaboom! Search the morgue for the body. Give me a gun with a flashlight. Cool. Okay. That don't look right. Ew. Stop! Stop! Stop looking at it! Oh my god! Guess you can't judge a corpse by its toe tag. Yeah, I'm not. No. I found the toe tag, Ferdinand Karamov. It's on some big black lady. Definitely not your guy. Okay, the agency have the lower floors on lockdown to prevent a leak. I got a guy who can cut the power to give you some help, but you'll have to get upstairs if you're gonna get out. All right, let's go. Oh my goodness, bro. Don't do that. Put him down, people. Back. Get back. Bro, that's a shotgun. Is that necessary? Okay. <laughs> um let's 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 play this smart. <laughs> we need to play this smart cuz that was a uh, not something we should be doing. You Poke your head. Is this guy dead? Did I pick up his ammo? Let me reload. Bro, <laughs> I can't aim. Like, my sensitivity is way too sensitive. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> Third time's a charm. We got this, right? He's dead. He's dead also. Oh my god! Ah! Okay, fourth time's the charm. Let's try this again. I'm not skipping the mission. You say Gusano's hit? That means worm. Oh, I shot his kneecap. Goodbye to your kneecaps. Carry on with your business. Okay, they're both dead. All right, let's book it. Okay, we need, we need all the. What the flip, bro? How did I die? Who was the other person shooting me? Oh my good. <laughs> Again, this is going to be the entire video, I'm not going to lie. So stay, like, just keep that in mind. Okay, I don't like you, sir. I got his face, bro. Issue. Contain mother the threat. Your mother. Just let me go. You motherfucker. Pick up the shotgun. There we go. Nice. 
Come back to this. I don't know what's going on here, but I want to fuck out. Okay. Let's pick up all the weapons. There's a guy right here. This the way out. Is he dead? Bro, how do you aim like that? Trust me. I'm not interested in the truth. Okay, give me back my shotgun. I made him suffer so bad. Okay. Uh, there's a guy in here. Hey, he's right there. Hey, I already died once today. There we go. Yo, we got this. We got this. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's just blood. Okay. Let's reload. Gather up all the weapons. There we go. Let's Stop. Okay, then, dude. To be here. Bro, where is he? It's all a big misunderstanding. Yeah, that's really annoying. There we go. Okay. We need another health pack. Just want to point that one out there. Michael, your weapons will be in a black bag and uh, clearance room top floor. Okay. We have to take the stairs. Containment, containment, containment. I should have stayed on the slab. I don't want to hear it. I'm using free aim. So just keep that in mind. There's people gonna come out. Yep. This is fucked. Yo, that sound of the gun sounded so cool. Let me reload this really quick. There, he's dead. It's over. Carry on with your business. What? How are you not dead? There we go. Killed him. Oh, shoot. Back the pistol. Push up. Yo, I'm good, bro. Oh, where's my black bag? I got him. Did I get it? Hey. Anybody else want some business to take care of? Coffin folder, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's raining outside. Ow, dude. What if I landed wrong? Alright, let's get a car. Oh, dude, I'm gonna get the Ranger over. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. How do I get out of here? Oh, I see it. Okay then. Oh, hi. Uh, goodbye. Alright then. We're making our escape. 
We gotta run. We gotta book it. Let's come down here. The LS River is one of the fastest ways of getting away from cops. So just point that out there. There we go. All we gotta do is camp out here for a little bit and then we're gonna be able to escape the police. So let's just uh let's just camp out here. Make sure there's no cops coming. I did a very good number of damage on this uh this ranger over here. It's all good though. The owner should have insurance, to say the least. Oh, there's a cop coming down. There we go. Hey, Mike. Oh, yeah. is this to the? Hey, we need to talk. Quick, meet me at those oil derricks just outside town, El Burro Heights, and make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. All right, let's go to the oil derricks. Oil Derricks? Dave, the hell was that? You know how many spooks I just ran into? I'm sorry. They're not nice people if that's a consolation. <laughs> What's going on? There's a big target out there. Something in the shadows. The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the Bureau or the agency, is going to get a big bump in funding. Like I care about your funding. I'm out, Dave. You're not. I need you to meet my boss. We'll be downtown in the plaza between the FIB and the IAA buildings. The IAA building? You fucking kidding me after the spat I just had with those agency men? Relax. They won't be looking there. They never expect an inside job. That's very shady, Dave. Okay. We're gonna do this, and then we're we're gonna wrap it off here. I'm trying to keep it really short. So this is we're at like 40 minutes already. Oh, no, gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip, a long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? You remember? I told you I know people, feds who looked after me when I retired. You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus. Christ, Franklin, I got so many stories I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. That's One true. Score with you, I made more money than I ever did hustling. But yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief, but you know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the bureau, man? This clown. I mean, he's an okay guy. Fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his. Everything was cool. Problem started when recently I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Uh, man, I, I think so. Shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's. I don't hell walking on earth. That's what he is. Well, let's bury this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, good luck with that. Shit. I mean, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look. I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. Okay, I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin. You'll swear I am an angel. So what's the mood here, man? I don't know. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, until I can find a way out of this shit. All right, man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. Franklin's no G, dude. Franklin. Man, I, I, oh, sorry. I'm trying to hear all that shit, man. If the Bureau ain't gonna take you to court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy, run me up a tree. Fuck that. This means a lot to me. Like I told you, I'm a terrific thief. I'll find something for you. 
big. Now, come on. You better take off. Alright, man. I'm with you. I'm Yo, with Franklin. You. Franklin's a good guy, man. Franklin's like the best character in this game. Like, he's very loyal. He's one of those where it's like, you helped me, I'm not gonna turn my back on you. He's he's a good guy, dude. Alright. I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna wrap it off already. We're at 41 minutes. Uh, save here. Perfect. Alright, guys. If you guys did enjoy this, uh, <laughs> if, you <laughs> if you guys did enjoy today's video, be sure to smack that subscribe button, smack that like button, and tap that bell icon to be notified about future videos such as uh, this one. And uh, if you guys do want to follow me over there on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all the links are going to be in the description below. Usually all I do over there is post like updates about YouTube and stuff I'm doing outside of YouTube. So you guys do want to check that out. Be sure to go follow those over there. Well, that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have an outstanding day. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.